The Philippines has received its first shipment of coronavirus vaccines. It was a Chinese donation of 600,000 Sinovac doses. And it comes after the nation's food and drugs regulator granted the vaccine makers emergency use request. The Philippines is expected to begin inoculations next week. And uh, as we know, as we understand, President uh, Rodrigo Duterte is currently at a ceremony welcoming the arrival of this batch of vaccines. And the country has been struggling to curb the spread of the virus. Now let's uh, go to our correspondent Gretchen Malalad, who's live in Manila for us from with more details. Gretchen, uh, what can you tell us about this shipment and how the rollout will uh, look like? Well, you know, Zhao Yang, the donated 600,000 Sinovac vaccines from China has just arrived a couple of minutes ago at William War Air Base, and it was delivered by a Chinese military plane. And uh, President Rodrigo Duterte witnessed the arrival of the vaccines. And as of now, there is an ongoing turnover ceremony where Chinese ambassador to the Philippines, Wang Silian, will turn over the vaccine to Health Minister Francisco Duque in a ceremony. So Sinovac will be the first vaccine that will be used for inoculating Filipinos. So as early as tomorrow morning, six government hospitals will be giving jabs to their employees. Although the local FDA did not recommend for Sinovac to be given to doctors and nurses directly working with COVID-19 patients, others, other employees, for example, who are doing admin administrative work are the ones who will be receiving the Sinovac jabs. The government said that the economic frontliners too will be the ones receiving the jabs and also uh, the military and police personnel will have the same jabs. Back to you. And Gretchen, give us an idea of uh, how the pandemic, uh, what the situation is like over there. I mean, we understand that Duterte has extended some coronavirus curbs in the capital until the end of March. Well, you know, Zhao it's very worrisome because COVID-19 infections have been on the rise for the past weeks. And the government has extended its quarantine lockdown until the end of March. And yesterday, the health ministry has reported that there are 2,921 new cases. And that it's the third day in a row that the country has averaged more than 2,000 cases a day. In fact, uh, Zhao Yang, there are 33 villages, small villages in Pasay City that were put in a localized lockdown for two weeks. Uh, the health ministry said that this might be due to quarantine fatigue and people started to attend celebrations uh, for the Chinese for the past Chinese New Year and also Valentine's Day. The health department has reminded Filipinos to remain vigilant. But with the start of the vaccination tomorrow, the government is hopeful that the numbers would eventually go down and the restrictions will be loosened.